going on guys? Video Matt here, hanging out in the Ventura Pier down in SoCal. Recently had the chance to meet up with Mike from the Devil Wears Prada. Check out the interview and the live footage, and I'll see you in a few. What's up? I'm Mike from the Devil Wears Prada, and you are watching Video Matt Presents. Off the way it did, because I mean, I was looking in you guys for a while, and then it's just like check back in a week later, and then it's just like on MySpace hits, and then you guys are keep on touring and not stop touring. It, uh, and no, I never expected it. Like when in Ohio, like in Dayton, like I didn't, like we heard Hawthorne Heights at that time was like, you know, that's when they just did like gold and all that, like. And, uh, you know, we heard about that and everything, but, like, all the local bands that I knew was, like, none of them really, no one was signed or anything, and I didn't know how any of that worked. I didn't know anything about distribution, booking, you know, tour managers, managers, uh, business managers, like, all this. Like, I had no idea about any of it, and re when I joined the band, it's just, like... <laughs> no, is, is your mom, I mean, is somebody, if it's somebody important, you can't take No, no, it's just you, a text. You, text. Uh, <laughs> um... I didn't know anything about all that stuff. Like, I didn't know how anything in the music industry worked. And uh, I didn't, it wasn't like, I want to do this and learn how to, it was nothing like that. And I don't think anyone else was that way either. It was just, you know, wanting to play shows. And that's all we really did was play shows, you know, and like kind of take the next step one to the other. Like, okay, now what should we do? Like, I remember like our first promo photos and recording our songs and stuff like that and just like trying to do what seemed right at the time and then I don't know just uh got got really lucky and blessed and was able to like with MySpace and everything and uh got the attention of Rise and just you know got the tour <laughs> A market shows are stuff like, you know, New York, Chicago. B market shows are the stuff outside the big cities. And um, this is the first, like, real B market tour we've done since uh, uh, Ultima Tour back in early 2008 with Maylene and Whitechapel. But it feels good to, to be back in the smaller places and, you know, going to shows where our fans can't make the drive out to, uh, you know, the couple hours to, like, L.A. or wherever. Uh, yeah wherever the tour is going, so. I mean, do you, with music now for you, do you understand why, like, you see how bands, you know, why they break up, or like, for me, I understand all the stuff that it takes, it's not just going on there and playing music. So, I mean, how does that kind of molded you as like a, as a person, taking on these new responsibilities, things that you wouldn't do? If you're back home in Ohio working at Guitar Center, uh, I, I, I don't even know. I don't even know how to explain. You know, like the pressures of being on tour is definitely weird and it's difficult to explain. And um, I don't know. Like I think the reason I, I tell people that we have been able to make it, even though we haven't been a band that long, just four years, five years, or whatever. Like, we've been able, I think what bonds us is the fact that we all have something in common and that we believe in God and want to talk about God to people. We're, you know, the farthest thing from from perfect as people and all this, but uh, it's still just kind of that, that common ground that uh, helps us to keep us together and try to stay as just general, positive, good people.
right, here's one last silly little question for you. It's actually like, I, w I want to answer. Try to give me the best answer you can for this question, okay? Why is it people go on the top of like the Empire State Building and pay money to look into binoculars just to look at the ground? <laughs> I'm trying to think of something clever here. Obviously, I can't. Is it so much as looking into the ground as trying to see something from a different perspective? Like looking at something that obviously, yeah, you could see if you were standing in front of it, but obviously seeing it from something like at this angle rather than like, you know? Yeah. Uh, just that's at, lame. I know yeah, that's lame. No, I just had that silly question. I was like, I'm going to fucking just throw a silly question at his ass and see what he thinks. And there, and there it was. So I don't even fucking really even know. But Mike, <laughs> thank you very much for sitting down with me. Dude. Yeah, it's been a pleasure. Video Matt hanging out the Devil Wears Prada. I don't know, but I go get the track. It'll be on iTunes soon. All right, another episode of Video Matt presents. Peace.